Today I wish to share with you a very simple meditation that I recommend for all beginners. It will get you started off really powerfully and it will facilitate your meditation or spiritual journey. Stick with this because it will be difficult in the beginning, but it will get so much easier and so much more natural. But you do have to get through the beginning phase where there has to be a lot of applied effort in order to get to the effortlessness. If you continue running away from this, if you are not consistent with this, you better not start at all. It's not going to help you otherwise. This cannot be more emphasized. With meditation, it's not so much all these other crazy things that you're doing, it's just consistency. That is the secret to it. You don't have to be good at it, you don't have to be, uh, you don't have to be fully understanding it even. As long as you stay consistent, everything will be taken care of for you, okay? So this is a meditation, again, that I recommend for beginners. What I want you to do first before we begin our meditation is hold your hands out in front of you. Now, I want you to actually bring your attention to your hands. Notice that I'm not asking you to think about your hands. I'm simply asking you to bring your attention to the sensations or the feelings of your hands. Close your eyes. Notice how your hands are still there and you are aware of that because your attention is on the sensations of your hands. You know that you have hands because there's a an awareness of a sensation where your hands are, right? There's a boundary of sensation of your hands. Without moving or touching your hands, you already know that your hands are present. That's because you're aware of the sensations of your hands. Keep your attention on your hands. If you wish, you can place your hands down at this time or keep them in front of you if it helps you. Over time, you're not going to practice with your hands up, so you know, feel free to place them down. But notice that this boundary of sensation that we are focusing on is still there. So the simple meditation practice that I'm proposing to you is learn to, learn to ground your attention in the sensation of your hands. It may only last two seconds and then you start thinking. Maybe you start visualizing your hands or you start talk, thinking about your hands or you start thinking about dinner later or how hard this is. The moment you catch yourself in thought, just Nothing to do about it. Don't feel bad about yourself. It happens. Just bring your attention back to your hands. Notice that you do not have to think about your hands to bring your attention to your hands. You can simply bring your attention to your hands. And when you are focused on the sensation of your hands, there's no thinking. Take a moment to acknowledge this. When you are focused in the sensation of your hands, there's no thinking. All you're going to do when you're sitting for meditation is that you are going to consistently, again and again, it's very repetitive, but it's simple at the same time, not much is being asked of you. Don't complicate it. Every time you find yourself lost in thought, which will be plenty of times, especially if you're just beginning, you're just going to keep bringing the attention, attention to your hands. Sometimes your attention may also just go to the breath, the sound of the breath or the feel of the breath. That's okay too. You can even feel free to alternate between attention of breath to breath and attention to hand sensation.
but very clearly begin to notice that when you are focused in hand sensation, when you are focused in the breath, there is no thinking. You are present. This will be hard at the, at, at the beginning because right now the attention is too scattered. It's too compulsive. It's not in your control. This is the practice which will start grounding your attention. It will start to dissolve the compulsiveness of your attention. And therefore, the fear, the anxiousness, the overthinking will go with it because those things only thrive off of your compulsive attention. Can you allow it to be this simple? However, it requires your consistency. The sensation of your hands right now may be very vague. You may not be so easily able to tune into them. But just continue bringing your attention back to the hands again and again, to the best of your capacity. And you will find that these sensations become more and more vivid, more and more clear, obvious. And bringing your attention to them becomes so simple. What I recommend for you now is you make a discipline out of this twice per day for 20 minutes each. You're going to sit down maybe morning and evening. You're going to close your eyes. You're going to simply sit and practice this. If you wish, you can put on some meditation music with no words, so no guided meditation, just meditation music, no words. And all you're going to do during that time is you're just going to bring your attention back to the sensation of your hands or the breath, or you can alternate, or you can do both. But during that time, it is important that you're not just lost in thought. Every time you do lose yourself in thought, that's okay. Just in that moment of remembrance, you bring yourself back again and again and again. And you will start to see that you will lose yourself in thought less and less. This gap of presence, silent, awake presence, will start to increase. Your spiritual practice will begin to deepen. The dysfunction of your life will start to dissolve. Meditation sets things right. It will harmonize your entire experience. It will help you understand the deeper, deeper spiritual understanding that currently feels too abstract. It purifies the mind. You must stay consistent. You do this twice per day for 20 minutes each in your sit-down sessions, silently. Even if it takes some months to really get good at this, you, you do that because you're devoted to this. And ultimately, it's, it's better to go through a period of effort for a few months and then, you know, experience the greater freedom that comes with that instead of just continuing to suffer all your life. So you stay consistent with that, with your sit-down sessions, and you do your best throughout the day as well. Throughout the day, whenever there's a moment of remembrance or you just find yourself in thought, you just return your attention to the sensation of your hands. Every time you do that, acknowledge the moment of silence, of clarity. This will start to grow and it will burn all of your mind's dysfunction and suffering. Practice this. I have many other resources on my channel and videos that you can watch to help you deepen your meditation, entire spiritual journey, many principles to live by. So you can, can, uh, you can take a look at that as well. I also do offer personal help 
So if you do desire personal, uh, personal help in a more structured way to apply this teaching and bring depth to your meditation practice and spiritual practice, then learn about my School of Awakening as well. I'll link that down below. I hope this video was helpful. If you have questions, please put them in the comments below. Uh, I'll see you next time.